629. Good morning. Welcome back into the CBS 42 Morning News. I'm Mark Franklin. We continue to track this breaking news out of Birmingham. Birmingham firefighters trying to figure out what caused this building to catch on fire overnight. CBS 42 News reporter Alex Finney has been at the scene all morning. She's joining us live with more from investigators. Alex, good morning. Good morning, Art. Well, we're still waiting to hear about a cause, but now that the sun has come up this morning, our viewers can really get a clear picture of what it looks like just off Cotton Avenue here in West End. We know that as a result of this fire, Pearson Avenue between Cotton Avenue and 14th Street Southwest remain blocked off this morning. So keep that in mind for people that are getting ready to head out. Out the street as a result of this fire. At one point, uh, we know that there were several. Now, the fire chief tells me that they were coming uh, actually just up the road on Pearson Avenue. They were working a trash fire there around 12 40 this morning. That's when they spotted this fire. Take a listen to what he had to say. There were several booms. Uh, I associate at least two of those with uh, the partial collapse of the building that you can see. Uh, behind me, and we had some marking of some uh, nearby power lines. Uh, since that time, the power company has secured the power to the, to the area. Now, crews will be back out here working hot spots. As for these bricks this morning, we know that Public Works has been notified about the collapsed walls. This structure is unstable, so of course they have this road blocked off for the time being. We don't know exactly when it will be back open, but we're going to continue to follow uh, this breaking news this morning. So stay with us right here on air and also online at WIAT.com. For now, live in West End, Alex Finney, CBS 42 News.